What's good, everybody? It's Fresh doing my Sunday video. For those of y'all that don't know, I'm doing my videos every Sunday, every Wednesday now. So make sure you look out for them and um, subscribe so then you can get a notification of when I do my videos. Um, so an ex of mine kind of inspired me to do this video. She called me up, just so happened to be the one that I talked about in the Baby Mamas one, and um, she called me up and she, I guess, is going through some shit. Why can't she find a relationship that'll last? And she's like, well, since you were with me the longest, like, that's why I'm asking you, like, what's wrong with me? Like, why can't I make it work and all this stuff whatever and she's like I've changed a lot like I can communicate more now and do this and do that and whatever and I'm like okay whatever but um I said whoa well, your main issue was your anger and like jealousy and I mean amongst other things but um what, Fifi? My puppy. Come here, Fifi. Come here. Look at my Fifi. Aww. Anyways, so, um, oh, she's all dirty. Um, so she's like, what's my problem? Why can't I find a relationship that lasts? And whatever. So we kind of, I guess you could say, talk for a little bit. And then, meanwhile, like, my girlfriend was laying right next to me. Didn't even trip. She don't care. That's why she's my girlfriend. Yeah. For those of you that don't know, I'm in a relationship now. And, um, then my ex was talking about, like, anyone that's after her is a downgrade. And I could not stop laughing. Okay. I'm sure, first of all, she's only talking about looks, which, no, no. And second, it ain't all about looks. You know the whole 80-20 rule? There are some instances where it's actually 20-80. The person you're with, you may think is, you know, all this, but then that next person... They have so much, like, good things about them that you're like, what did she have? Like, really? Like, my girlfriend now, she cooks for me. She, like, helps me with laundry. Like, we don't even live together yet. And with my ex, I had two kids. She had three. Like, I would drop the kids off at school, go do laundry, go straight to work. She was a stay-at-home mom with no kids at home. And the house would be dirty. She would be sleeping all day. I would come home and she'd be taking a bath. I'm like, I don't want to take a fucking bath. The fuck? Yeah. And, um, back to my girlfriend now. Um, like the one morning we were up late. She, um, got up in the morning, made me French toast. Why I stayed home and she went to go do laundry with my daughter. Yeah. I'd say definite, definite upgrade from the chicks that I'm used to. No offense to my exes watching this. Because some of y'all weren't that bad. It just didn't work out. But some of y'all, you know who you are. No. Oh, isn't she cute? Anyways. Um, like, she told me, she tells me, like, to text her, let her know when I'm on my way home so she can have my food warm for me, like, if I don't feel good, like, taking care of me, anything, like, she just got done rubbing my back for, like, a good half hour at least, and then now she's making dinner. She's freaking awesome. But, um... I'm so tick, sick of the sick and tired of the expression of downgrading or upgrading or whatever 
if you're with somebody and they make you happy and they whatever like it doesn't downgrade upgrade all that first of all if they're not with you and they're with somebody else to them they upgraded already you're definitely a downgrade that's why they're not with you make sense but I'm sick and tired of it being only based on looks. Because first of all, what you think is cute, the next person might not think is cute. Second, they're always going to think the other chick is uglier. Like, um, um, Foxy Hot Mess. She has a YouTube. If any of you guys haven't seen her, you should check her out. She does this video about, like, the new girlfriend. And she's like... <laughs> Making up stuff basically about the new girlfriend like to try to diss her like it's fucking hilarious You should watch it and um That's basically how it is with females like You don't understand okay, and then chick used to hit me right um Lying to me straight to my face That's a whole nother story like, all kinds of shit, and it's like, I don't have to deal with that now, so I definitely say I upgraded. Last night I went out to the club, um, a friend of mine who actually, like, I don't know if you would say has a crush on me, she met me up there, um, my, one of my exes slash baby mama, whatever, from a long, long, long time ago, I found her on Facebook, she ended up meeting up with me. And my girlfriend didn't trip. Exactly. That's why she's my girlfriend. And ain't shit gonna happen. Because I'm not gonna cheat on her. I'm not gonna do that kind of shit. Especially, like, knowing that I have a good female. Like, anyways. I upgraded. Let me upgrade you. Upgrade you. Anyways, hope y'all have a good day, and I'll see y'all again on Wednesday. If you guys have any, like, topic ideas or anything like that, of course, let me know. Like the video. Comment on the video. Subscribe. And share the video. Especially if you have some ex that thinks that your new chick is ugly or whatever, like... Let them, let them know. Nah, I upgraded. Have a good one.